Thank you, Colin. All new tonight, hundreds of people came out to Wheeling Park's White Palace today for a special event to raise awareness for people with disabilities. 7 News reporter Jake McGlumphy shares how the event got started and how much of an impact it has on the community. It is an event that gives new life and opportunity to those who face mental and physical disabilities every day. The third annual Inclusion on Ice saw many people come out to lace up their skates and take to the rink for an afternoon filled with fun. The event also included face painting, a selfie station, a resource fair, and much more. The idea for the event came from David George, who is a local author and advocate for those with special needs and disabilities. He says while it is meant to give people facing challenges new opportunities, it is also something that intends to bring the community together in many ways. At the same time, it's designed to uh, tap into the community in such a way where we emphasize cultivation, integration, inclusion of all persons, regardless of whether they have uh, special needs or so-called disabilities. One local organization that helps organize the event looks for ways to engage those who face mental and physical barriers every day. The marketing director for Easter Seals, Betsy Bethel McFarland, shares how much of an impact the event can have on families in the community. A lot of times if you if you have a, a child with disabilities, you don't get to go to all the things that everybody else does because it's just too difficult. There's too many barriers in your way. And so this is specifically set up to eliminate those barriers and give the whole family a fun time to come out and do something that, you know, a lot of us just take for granted. Those who made their way onto the ice also had an opportunity to skate with some Wheeling Nailer hockey players. The Community Relations Director for the Nailers, DJ Abicella, says how fascinating it is to see local organizations come together to provide new hope for the community. It's amazing to see how much everybody really cares about the lifestyle of this community as a whole and giving people these experiences that they're going to remember for lifetimes. The event also featured a sensory room designed by the Augusta Levy Learning Center. The executive director for Augusta Levy, Angie Wood, shares how great it is to see everyone share in the fun being had. It's just wonderful to see everybody having fun together. So regardless of your abilities, we're just all having fun in it together. Um, and it's just an amazing, incredible event. Reporting in Wheeling for 7 News, I'm Jake McGlumphy, working for you. Thanks, Jake. WTRF was the proud media sponsor of this year's event.